Hello everyone, the weather forecasters promised us a very pleasant day for football and that's exactly what we've got. I'm Derek Ray, joined by Lee Dixon in the commentary position. And we have live extra class coverage coming right up. This ought to be a fantastic watch, Lee. Yeah, the talking is over, the game plans are set. Now it's up to the players to go out and earn their corn. There's nothing the managers can do once the first whistle goes. I think, Derek, we're in for a cracker. But it's true to say they've lacked a bit of spark in their home matches, so no great surprise to see that they have the worst home record in the league. Well, four wins in 15 games doesn't bode well for anyone connected to this club. The visitors will really fancy their chances here today. I think it could go either way, to be honest. And the lineup for the home side. I'll tell you what, you don't see this formation every day of the week. No, I mean, it looks very attack-minded with the three up front. The three in midfield supplying the width as well, but I'm a little bit worried about the three centre-backs. Will they get exposed in the wide areas? And this is the initial 11 for the visitors today. Now, there has been some discussion about their style of play. Some would argue it's on the negative side. What realistically should we expect, Lee? Yeah, they do tend to collapse when they don't have the ball. They sit off the opposition, almost inviting pressure onto them before trying to open up when they do have the ball. I don't think we'll see any changes today in that approach. What can they do to stop him running at them? Good idea, that particular move, but not to be. And successfully cut out. Friedrich. that final pass you just feel and a chance for them to nudge in front couldn't quite hang on Matras it's with Albin Granund this attack looks highly promising it's opening up for them Real danger. Still pushing for that goal that would see them forge ahead. Maciej Sadlock. Nice looking pass. Pass after pass, keeping their opponents moving. Under pressure, doesn't seem to be bothering him. Matras. Mateusz Matras. Is it going to end up being productive for them? Might take the lead. And it's in! 1 0. They've breached the defence.
Well, here's the replay, and it's a lovely through ball to set up the chance. And then the sheer power of the strike, really impressive. It's a thunderbolt. One nil then. Yeboah. The hosts have really controlled possession, but it's just whether they can convert that possession into clear-cut chances. You sense they need to pick up the pace a little, start utilising the wide areas more. The back line's doing a decent job. Hopefully the forwards can do that as well. Well, they stopped them in their tracks. Now he must favour the cross. Fruitful looking attack. Good looking cross. That is a moment he would dearly love to have back, if possible. Yeah, it wasn't his best effort, was it? But I bet he thought, I haven't got anything on. Why not try a shot? Granlund and one minute of stoppage time has been added on now can they make something happen options in the centre went in strongly to win the ball so there goes the half-time whistle and as far as our hosts are concerned another tale of playing under pressure at home things don't seem to be changing well Derek they are only a goal away from getting back into this game trouble is with their history and their record it doesn't bode well let's see if they can string two passes together and get themselves back into this Plenty to consider based on what we've seen so far as the second half begins. Excellent defending. Mateusz Matras. Plenty of forward momentum here, but can they produce? And unable to keep possession. Yeboa. Oh, nice ball over the top. A room to roam on the wing. Fine cross into the middle. Well, mopping up defensively. Matras. It is to be a throw-in. Substitution time it is here. Friedrich and we're inside the final 30 minutes difficult to stop him well they keep working away looking for an opening an attack full of promise can they get in behind them 
Well, that is a defender's job to come to the rescue. A good-looking move. The visitors are struggling with possession, really. But again, we've seen it before. We'll see it again. Their counter-attack play has been absolutely fantastic. Pace really hurts defences, and they've got that in abundance. Can he put it in? And there it is! A two-goal cushion now, and they just need to keep the concentration. Well, here we see it again, and it's all about the pace of the passing. One touch, slick movement, but you do have to ask questions about the keeper. Could he have done better here? I think so. You can't keep getting beat at the near post like that. So, 2-0 now. Wasczykowski. And it's a matter of what occurs in the final 15 minutes. Moving into the advanced position. Just cutting off the supply. Forcell. Oh, nice ball over the top to chase. And delivered towards the back post. And a goal! If there were any remaining doubts, that will settle the issue. Well, we can see it again here. What a lovely inviting cross into the danger area that was. And what a great finish as well. Good connection with the ball, leaving the goalkeeper absolutely no chance. Fantastic goal. Well, if there were any lingering doubts about the outcome, surely they now have been removed. Running with the ball confidently. Fruitful looking attack. Teammates in the middle. That's all they can conjure for now. What can he do from here? Yoya Boa. And now the full-time whistle. Another disappointing day for the home fans. Their abysmal record continuously. Well, it's the same old story, Derek. And I think their confidence is absolutely shot to pieces. Lots of frustration amongst the fans as well. And to be fair, watching that week in, week out, you'd be frustrated too. They really need to improve now and try and get these fans back on side.